What is going on guys and welcome to another Destiny 2 video. Today we're going to be taking a look at the new weapon foundry called Vice. Yes, it's a brand new weapon foundry that is being introduced into Destiny 2. So far at the Destiny reveal event, we got a chance to try three of these weapons. One was the SMG, another one was a sidearm, and the other one was a sniper rifle. One of the cool aspects about this weapon, each of this weapon, the foundry, allows you to move fairly, fairly quickly throughout the map. So it gives you the ability to have fast movement when having one of these weapons equipped. All three of them gave you that perk. One of my favorite things about this foundry is the way the color schematics work within the weapons. It makes them look nice and clean. So let's go ahead and take a look at the first weapon. Let's start off with the SMG called the Red Mamba 3MG. This is SMG. We got a chance to test it out at the event. It's very hard to kind of give you a narrow path on how good SMGs are because we had very limited amount of time to actually test these out. But as soon as the beta goes live, for sure, I will have an in-depth review on the SMGs. The next one we're going to be looking at is the sidearm called the Urchin 3SI. Now this schematic, I mean, this look, weapon looks so beautiful. It has a white schematic and it comes with that neon green. It just looks very, very nice. And one of my favorite looking sidearms currently right now that, you know, in Destiny 2. I, we haven't seen all of them, but this, this one looks really, really nice. The last weapon we got to test from this foundry was the Copperhead 4SN. Now, this is a sniper rifle. And as you guys know, sniper rifles now are part of your heavy slot. So do keep that in mind if you guys plan on rocking a sniper. Now, this is the brand new foundry. I want to know from you guys, what do you guys think of this weapon foundry? and it being added into Destiny 2. As you guys know, we already have different foundries that are going to remain in Destiny 2. That's, of course, being Soros, Omnilong, Tex, Mechanica, and Hake. But please let me know in the comment section down below what can we expect out of this brand new foundry. Don't forget, guys, for all things Destiny 2, make sure you keep it locked on this channel, and I will catch you guys on the next video.